YouTube, what is going on? J-Dub here with Second City Kicks, or it's Josh with Se Second City Kicks. Whatever you want to call me, that's fine. Just let's not get uh, inappropriate. So, as I told you guys, I'll be back sometime this week with a couple more pickups. And I am back, obviously, because you're watching the video. And one thing I'm going to ask you guys to do, hit that subscribe, hit that like button if you like the content. Um, you know, I, everybody that's a subscriber knows that I'm very honest. I give you my opinion on a shoe. Um, if I think you should pick it up, if you, if you, if you don't pick it up, um, every shoe that I pick up is something that I like and I just want to spread my opinion on it and hopefully give you guys the ability to make a decision on my opinion. And that's it. So let's get on to the box first. And this is FYI PSA. Uh, this is not a boo shoe. This is Adidas shoe, but it is not a boo shoe. So those of you that are looking for a boo, boo shoe, you can leave or you can stay. Check out the check out the video. It's up to you. Here we go. On to the box. The Adidas Tennis Hue. And uh, for those of you that don't know, this is the Adidas and Pharrell Williams collaboration. As you guys can see, we have a, the Pharrell Williams uh, logo here and the Adidas the Adidas logo in a multicolor uh, color there. Uh, there is the sizing and the item code and the barcode. On the top of the box we have the HU 2017 with the number three up top up there on the top of the triangle. And it's a very basic box. It's like a, an off-white with a little bit of marbling. And I don't know if that's going to show up on camera. Probably not, but um, there is a little bit of marbling on there, but it's a very very good very basic box nothing on the bottom as you guys can see So uh, very very basic box. So onto the actual shoe itself There it is Now I have tried these on so I can give you my sizing Opinion, but we'll get into the we'll get into that in a second So I'll let you guys soak in the shoe here as you guys can see it is a multi-color very 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 bright uh bright these are actually brighter than the the adidas ultra boost 3.0 multicolor in my opinion and you'll see why in a couple seconds actually you've probably already seen it but i'm going to show it to you and i point it out so um so let's uh there's the side this would be the outside uh, of your right foot and as you guys can see it those yellow laces and you have that multicolor. Now, as you get into the toe, you, as you guys can see, there is a lot of yellow, but there is also a lot of color mixed in there. But and you're, if you're if you if you have your foot like this and you're standing up and you're looking down, the shoe looks mainly yellow with a lot of color mixed in. So just FYI, as we go into the end part of the shoe, you have more of that multicolor. And Adidas was very very subtle on doing the. Uh, three stripes branding on these which is it's it's kind of hard to see unless you're like looking i mean it's not hard to see i mean it stands out but it's not like like a uh, like a nike check mark on the side of a shoe where it's like you know it's there so as you guys can see here here and here is your three stripes branding for the adidas uh which is awesome as we spin around to the back we have that adidas pharrell williams logo again on the back and this is more of a neoprene material it does fold up. Uh, I'm not sure why it does that, but that's what it does. And uh, you have like a uh, like a nylon liner, which is not very stretchy on the sock liner. And then as you go on to the toe, or I'm sorry, the tongue, you have that suede or leather hit with the Adidas and the uh, Pharrell Williams Hue uh, logo up here again. And that goes all the way onto the inside of the tongue. There's that. So there's nothing on the back, just straight leather here. So, and then as we go to the inside of the shoe, we have this crazy insole. Now I want to get in a little bit closer because it's probably hard to see. And as you guys can see, you have that Adidas Pharrell Williams logos right there. Let that focus. There you go. And then this, it pretty much gives you all the organs in the body as you go all the way down this insole. Very, very cool touch. I do like it a lot. Um, and as I said, it labels everything. So I'm not sure the purpose behind that, but they are there. So nothing on the back, just your neon green insole. So the other thing is on the, on the laces themselves, 
And again, I'm going to try to do my best to pick this up. They have the three stripe branding on the uh, on the actual aglets, as you guys can see there. Very cool touch. Very cool touch. Let's see, that's picking that up. There you go, right there. Very nice touch, in my opinion. I do like that. So. Any questions, comments, concerns about this shoe, these shoes, this shoe, this particular shoe right here? Oh, I forgot to tell you about the bottom. <laughs> EVA midsole, which goes down into the outsole. Pick this up there. You have black rubber here, EVA midsole, black, another piece, piece of rubber here, and then EVA all the way through. So, very, uh, this is a very casual shoe. I would not recommend running in this. I would not recommend running this in water because there's probably not very, uh, not a lot of traction. Um, you might might wind up busting your head open while wearing these. This is more like a summer shoe. You know, if you live in, in California, San Diego area, you'll probably be fine. If you live in Vegas, you'll probably be fine. If you live in Nevada, you'll probably be fine. As you get closer to the East Coast, you're probably gonna have a hard time wearing these all year round. But um, this shoe does run very long. I did go with a 12 and a half my true to size because I've never had these before and I could have went with a 12 but they fit okay I have a little bit of room in the toe because the toe is reinforced not a huge deal um, but you can go I'd say you can probably go a half size down possibly a full size down uh, depending on how tight you like your shoes because there is this is this whole toe box area is all reinforced and it comes reinforcement comes up to about here on the toe so I'm not sure what it would feel like if you got your toes under there. Um, it is pretty firm, but there will be an on there will be an on foot, so you guys will see that, and uh, I'll do my best to show you um, what I can show you on the on foot. So again, guys, I appreciate you guys checking out the channel. Please hit the subscribe and like button for me one more time, and I will uh, see you guys sometime later in the week. Thanks.